once that you have been washed and made clean, you have no fear. There's no fear within you. You have no fear of death. Amen. You're low. Amen. When you pass from this life into a better place. Heaven is real. And if there's a heaven, there's a hell to shun. Amen. I tell you tonight, you do not listen to me. You do not have to go to hell. God loves you. God prepared a place for you. He sent his son to die on a cross for you. You do not have to spend eternity in hell. But if you die in your sins, where I am, Jesus said, you cannot come. You don't have to die there. Glory to God. I tell you, uh, amen, that there's the power of God in this place. Uh, that tonight, uh, the power of God is in your home tonight. Uh, amen. Uh, if you need something from God, uh, amen, you can dial that telephone. Jonathan is there to pray with you. Amen. And you know Jonathan. Amen. He'll pray with you all night uh, if that's what it takes. Amen. He's alive today. He's alive today. Amen. I'd like to read a little bit more scripture to you. The fourth chapter of Second Corinthians says, But if our gospel be hid, it is hid to them that are lost, in whom the God of this world hath blinded the mind of them, has blinded the mind of them which believe not. Amen. Lest the light of the glorious gospel of Jesus Christ, who is the image of God, should shine unto them. Amen. Know ye not, friend, amen, that the God of this world, amen, which is, we call him Satan, or the devil, amen, he has blinded the minds of so many people in our nation today, amen. They walk around 20-20 vision and yet walk around blind, amen. They're so turned off, amen, to the Bible, and so turned off, amen, to the way of life that we all grew up around, amen. This area in around here, amen, where this TV station is going out to, amen, it's a local area, and people that hear this, amen, they have been there. They've seen what God will do, and Jesus Christ, he's still alive. He's the same yesterday, today and forever. Yes, he will change not. Amen. Uh, I want to tell you something. Uh, as I was getting to it a little bit ago, amen, Paul, uh, amen, when he got ready to give his life, uh, he knew that they was going to take him out, uh, amen, uh, to the guillotine, uh, amen, and, uh, and, uh, and severe his head. It's a bad thought, but they used to do that, folks. They hung uh, our Savior on the cross. They took... Uh, and it took Paul out, uh, but he, you know what? He said, uh, the time of my departure is at hand. Amen. The time of my departure is at hand. Amen. He said, but I am now ready, and the time of my departure is at hand. Amen. But I have fought a good fight. Amen. I've finished my course, and I have kept the faith. Amen. And that's what I'm talking to you about tonight keeping the faith, walking, amen, with him, uh, talking to him, amen. But I, before I get too far in this tonight, I don't have a lot more time, amen. But I'd like to tell you one thing. I've been at, talking to some of my friends, asking them, amen, for this month, amen, to spend with me about 30 minutes a day in prayer, reading the Bible or concentrating or praying, whichever one you want to do. It don't matter what time of day it will. I'd like to see how many people would do that. Call this station, amen. And I, this station needs your support, amen. Your prayers, but also financially, amen. So support the station here, uh, Jonathan, in this station, amen. Send your, pr send your prayer request, amen, but send your pledges here, amen. You have a support the station, amen, because it's a station that's reaching out, amen, to so many people, in this area, amen. Jesus loves you tonight, and he cares for you. I want to talk to you just a minute, amen. 
you that, you that called in for salvation, find a place to pray. Amen. Yeah. Right now, find a place to pray. Amen. Kneel down someplace. Tell God, amen, that you are tired of sin. You see, we was all there at one time, Brother Jonathan. Brother Jonathan was there. His brother here was there. We, we was all in sin at one time. We all had to make the decision, amen, do I want to go on in sin and live a life in misery or do I want to live a life, amen, of prosperity? Do I want to live a life, amen, walking in the pleasures and in the glory of God? I tell you that God is alive tonight. I don't know how much more time I've got, brother. Have we got time for another song or what?